Christmas came early for an 11 year old girl in Florissant tonight. Her story inspired her community to come together to make the night special. Cardio News Channel 13's Rana Novini brings us the story that's Colorado strong. If there's one thing you should know about Alexandra, she's loved everything. It's that she's always smiling. Big lover. She loves life. Last year, she was presented with a battle most 11 year olds will never know brain cancer. She, um, Went through three bone marrow transplants and major radiation and chemo. Doctors did what they could. And they found out that she had severe radiation damage to her spinal cord that has been irreversible. Now, Alexandra is home. Each day is uncertain. Her family isn't sure she'll make it to her favorite holiday. She's very excited for Christmas. She wanted a real tree, and so her daddy went out back and <laughs> cut her down a real tree. If Alexandra can't make it to Christmas, up and all the way around, Christmas will come to her. Friends, neighbors, the fire department, people who never met her fill her front yard to bring her her favorite day. We wish you a Merry Christmas week. Just beyond the front door, Merry Christmas week. We wish you a Merry Christmas. Alexandra takes in every note, every picture of her Christmas. She even manages to sing along. It's a parent. This has got to be the toughest thing. And I'm a parent, and it tears me up. It's nice to see a group of people that can come together and do something positive, even in a time of tragedy, because uh, this is tragic. It's tragic to lose a child. Santa Claus is coming to town. You know, with the snow falling and the lights and the people singing, a lot like Christmas. This Christmas, everything Alexandra wants is here. Alex is so much full of love. And she wants everybody to know that it makes her sad when people are sad about her. She doesn't want them to be sad. She wants everybody to be happy, to live life, and to have a Merry Christmas. <laughs> Though her battle with cancer might come to an end, nothing will beat her smile. somewhere between 150 and 200 people at Alexandra's house tonight and she says she hopes people will remember this Christmas is about the friends and family you have with you and not about the presents. Yeah. And obviously it's touched you and those around her. What a brave young girl. Yeah. Thanks for telling her story. Mm.